Hey guys, and welcome back to Dominions 5 with me, Demo Tactics. It's been actually a few weeks since I last played. I was away for the holidays. Now that it's a new year, let's go back and check out and see how we're doing here. Um, okay, so if I remember correctly, we're fighting the Uruk over here. Yes, we are. And they're in the Farsir Mountains. We had a couple of uh, battles against our fortifications. We took back Karnag. I remember that. Ishukalu, one of our Lizard Kings, which he has a very small army here of elite warriors and a few guards as well. They're moving north away. So if the units here in Farseer Mountain, 50 of them, Enkidu Spearmen, Enkidu Heavy Archers and Claymen, I don't know what the Claymen are, but anyway, if they move down here and, and try to lay siege to Karnag, we can come back. Or can we? Lugal Segesi, we're moving up here. We're moving north. We're not actually going to after these. Oh, well, wait a minute. They can't come across here. It is actually uh, winter. Well, it's fall. And uh, as you can see, it's not possible to get through the mountains. Okay, that's good. Okay, so we're safe here. That's why I'm moving back there. This army, well, I guess two armies. We have, okay, we have these Sobek generals decked out with a Wraith Sword. They're going to get... They're getting extra hit points back if they make do damage. Life drain. Yeah, up to five hit points of damage will yield a life drain benefit. You will get half a hit point and two fatigue points per hit point drained. Okay, that's good. And the horror helmet will put fear in the enemy. That's going to be very good. And we have a champion skull, which gives us experience. Three per month. You're up to 35 now, so he's level one. And we're going to need, I think it's, what, 60 for the next one? I think so. And then Ninja Bargunu only has a Bane Blade, that decay damage, which I think is pretty quick to reduce an enemy's stats, which helps a lot if you're fighting somebody who's really good, right? If you have a lot of chaff you're fighting against, it doesn't do that much, right? But still, his stats are going to be pretty decent, right? Protection 20, Defense 9, but they have, and they're also uh, blessed, right? They can be blessed. They're sacred. They have units here, both of them. Let me see. Ninja Bargunu, he has five guarding him. Five Sobek Sacred Guards, and they are tough. They're definitely tough. And he has a pretty good army here, too. Ninja Bargunu. Plus two morale for my elite warriors. And then we have a couple of these uh, Sacred Crocodiles, which are huge, right? 73 hit points. Otherwise, very slow, but can also be sacred. What do we actually have for our blessed? So let's take a look at that in a minute. Shitter is here as well. Also guarding, not as good. Actually, we have a quite a few units there. We can take one of them. Can we move them up there? One more out? Yeah, let's do that. And then we can take one of these, move them up there as well. Yeah, I should do that, obviously. We're getting a, a blessing here. Do we need that? Yeah, we do need that blessing because we don't have anybody else who can do it. There's not a level three priest here who can do blessing for everybody. Stalagmia has a few of these cavemen. Am I leaving them here? Because we're moving up. So these units are all moving north into Sasevic Highlands, right? Um, there. We're also getting these. Oh no, only one. Yeah, that's just a uh, hero duel moving north uh, southeast into Sasevic Highlands as well. So there's really nothing special there. But what are we going to do with them there? Well, we're going to have to see if we can push out from Sasevic Highlands. You can always get through to Numecria. You can't always go to Okals. Right now it's good. You know, the orange there. But uh, later on in winter, it's not going to be good. It's open. Well, you know, province defense, right? But still, other than that, hmm. There's nothing here in any world. And that's fine, right? It's winter now. We are safe here. We have a few, you know, province defense, but I want to take Numecria. Mineral Cave, Starlit Pond, and Singing Stream. All good. One Earth Dim at the Mineral Cave. Starlit Pond gives you one Astral Pearl, and Singing Stream, two Water Gems. What do we get here in return? Three Water Gems, which I, I like that a lot, because that way we can get that the Sea King's Court <laughs> eventually, right? Uh, Death Gems, plus six. Which is a lot, which is good, because we're using that at home in Satis, I think. In Satis, aren't we getting, oh, let me see if I remember here, reanimation, right. And we're using 
that for them. Amulet of the Dead. Ritual the animation bonus too. Yeah, that's what we're doing here. What do we have here? Tis anyway. We took everything we had. No, no, we didn't take everything. N Ninma here. Undead. And we need him, the Empoisoner, because he can have up to 30 undead units. Okay, it's coming back to me there. Okay, that's good. So we're pushing in to a specific highlands with this army. So we should take the cavemen, I think. If we do that, go up to the Pacific Highlands and then into Namekria and take that from them, pretty soon they're not going to have too much to recruit from, right? We're taking our units in Godwoods, which is a little bit risky, maybe. Defense 6. We have money. No, we don't have money anymore. Because the units here could come back here, right? I don't know what they have. Not very many. And they may not want to do that, but Namekria seems to be a bigger you know, target, a better target for us to go for with this units here, these units here. What do we have? Um, yeah, well, take a look at it, pressing T. Not legal, there is fanaticism. That is good, right? He is our best guy, right? Level four priest. That's why he can do fanaticism. What's his heroic ability? Tough skin, he's good by himself, actually. Protection 11, defense skill 20. Attack 19. He could do some damage. But do I really want him in the front? Our Prophet? No, not really. He's going to be in the back. I should give him maybe some some items. Although he has five of these Sobic Sacred Guards with him as well. What else do we have? In Ninu? Okay. He's going to be in there attacking. Um, guarding the Commander. Okay. Yahina is our Pretender. The Wadjet. And five of these Sobic Sacred Guards. Yeah, that, that's what I want. Are they at the same speed? Uh, it doesn't really matter, I guess. They're going to follow. And the combat speed, 9, 10. They can't quite keep up, can they? Okay, th that sounds good to me. What do you have here? You have a rabbit foot charm. So twist fate, which means that the first attack in the turn will be um, negated. And that means we won't uh, die as easily, right? Have a few gems as well. Okay, that's fine. So we're going to go in with these units. How many is that total? Only 68? Oh, that's the garrison here, right? 40 here, yeah. No, it is 68. That is exactly what it is. 68 is all these, yeah. So, I think that will be enough, right? He's going to have province defense, but because we have our prophet, we have our pretender, I think it would be okay. Are we recruiting anything here? And by the way, where do we have our dominion? We have it here. Okay, anywhere we attack here, we're going to be fine. Okay, that's good. That's going to be good. Uh, are we recruiting an end rule? We are. Just getting straight up the elite warriors. I think that's fine. Yeah, so that's here. I'm going to hold this. Because by the time spring rolls around, if we don't pick up these units, we're going to have a lot of them left. We can't get in there with anybody else. Should we actually recruit a commander? We are recruiting a commander. I'm ahead of myself. Uh, Lizard Lord. Okay, good. He can take care of that. Okay, that takes care of the East. What about the West here? We know Oceania likes to attack. Vongar. We have a Lizard King here. Oh no, that's a Marshmaster. That is a Marshmaster. <clears throat> He's defending. Yeah, Cold Bolt. Okay, I picked something here. Range 50. One person. Damage 19. Fatigue 20. Okay, yeah, it's good. Yeah, and then he has command. Oh, the Marsh Master can also have undead. 60 of them. And he has 48. No, hmm. He doesn't have any units defending him. Is that a wise move? Probably not. Minus one morale. He's standing here. They're together, so they should be defending each other. But you know what I want to do? If we take these two. Move them down there. Yeah, God the Commander. That's fine. More important to me to have... Actually, take all three. Let's not quibble. Okay, so they're going to defend here. I don't know if they're going to attack. We'll see. Doesn't have that many units, it looks like. Oceania. So that's in Vongar. Jinport. They'd like to attack Jinport. We have 20 in province defense. Pretty decent. But morale is always the problem, right? What else do we have? Well, we have 43 units. To be a dingery, he has four defender, four, four guards there. Preaching, okay, you're preaching there as well. Can't, yeah, we can preach still. Level one, dominion. 
and you're level one priest, still fine. Once we go to level two, then we can't do anything there. We should get more. I mean, we should get more temples. The AI always goes for a lot of temples. We have one, two. We haven't spread out in pretty decent spots, but if we spread our dominion here, we really should get one maybe in an umbral, you know, I would think. Green marshes. Do we have these? Yeah, we have lots of units here. We're moving away, though. Moving away with everybody. And then you. Okay. We are moving back a few units. But only a very few. Defense 10. I don't have any money, so I can't do anything right now. I don't think he's going to attack this turn. What do we have at home in Cetis? These vine men, we're getting them every turn. Protections. They're pretty weak here. A lot of hit points. Relatively speaking, and morale is excellent. I do like that a lot. You can count on them. So if we have them, what else do we have down here? Do we have, yeah, this one. They're being guarded. Ninma over here is not very good. Leadership 15. The Marsh Master. 10. Hmm. 60, yeah. So you can see the numbers here. They can have 10 normals, so minus one. And same thing, I think, for the Empoisoner. Yeah, minus one. Nobody else can have undead, I don't think. Nope, no undead. So magic is what we want for the vitamin, isn't it, though? Yeah, we can have five there. Marshmaster, 15. Can anybody else have the magic? Yeah, I don't think so. 15 here, but no better leadership. We will probably want to get an item or something that we can have more magic magic beings, right? Because right now, the vine men, who's going to control them? You can have them as bodyguards. That's pretty much it. If you can have five, right? So I wonder then, what item... Do I want to get focus on that? If you look at... We are researching shops here. And what is research for hotkey? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's research. What is Forge Magic item is F. So it would be a miscellaneous, right? Something we can get. Water breathing, anti-magic. We have a lot now, actually. All right, the void. We want to have magic. Skullmenter, no, that can't do anything. That's for that's for research. That is very good. Plus 14. Bane Venom Charm, no. Uh, Horn of Valor, that's morale. And this bag of wine. Amulet of Giants. Nope. Nope, I don't see anything here. I was just looking through them. We don't have any item that we can do, unless it's something on a helmet or something like that. Mistletoe Garland. There was one item that gives you command over the undead, but that's about it. So here's another one. 75. You can have 75, which is great. Which is actually Crown of Bones. Inspirational minus one, but yeah, that'd be good for one of our big commanders, actually. Spirit Mask. These are new. I mean, new. I haven't seen him here before. Um, Crown of Command. Magic Command 25. Here it is. That's the one I want. 10 Astral Pearls. I mean, it's not super great, but give it to a mage. Too low level. What do we need? Astral Magic level 2. Yeah, he can't do that. Who can do it? Nobody, right? We don't have any Astral Mage level 2. We don't. And I don't think we can actually get anybody. The Marshmaster is the closest we can get. Nope. Yeah, he could be too, right? Very, very unlikely. I don't think we have much as far as... Yeah, there's one there, but that's only one. Marshmaster is what we would hope for in that case. Or what we could do is we could, you know, empower them. But again, that will cost a lot. What am I making here? Astral 15... Making two. Yeah, it's not very much. Now, anything you have, any other kind of gem, can be converted to astral pretty inexpensively. Because it's only one step, right? From earth gems, you get two earth gems into one astral pearl. If you go from earth to death, it's going to cost you four. So astral pearls are good to convert to. Like we could do the water gems. But I don't want to do that. I want to keep it for my, uh, for my Sea King's Court. Now, let's look at the uh, research. What do we have? Conjuration level 6. We're level 5 right now. 389. We're making 214. So two turns we'll get level 6. What do we have here? Okay. Yep. That's right. Conjuration. That's where we get our sacred crocodiles. 
monster toads, which we're not doing anything with. Level 6 gives us what? That is the Sea King's Court. Really, that's what I want, right? Eventually. 55, but before we get there, we have to empower somebody. Okay, well, we'll, we'll, um, we'll keep that one in mind. So that's all I'm doing. Construction level 5, construction level 6 next, and those I do like, because they're level 4 right now. And then we go up here. So, power, very powerful magic items. I would love to get that. Do we need to do anything else down here? We have a commander we can pick up units with. There is... Oh, we have two of these. Don't think I need... Well, let's leave them here for now. Let's do that. I think we're okay here. Nobody's going to take us on here. We always have units here. Roaming around, you know, just waiting. Yeah, so I think we'll be okay. Ninmai is moving away down here. Okay, so looking down south, what do we have? Moving units from Satis down here to Yongkeep. That's Ninma, which was uh, here. Yeah, moving down there. What if we go down there? We're getting an army. No, wait, who's moving? Visik is moving. Okay, Visik is moving in here. So if they do attack down to Karnak, if it opens up, we have an army under Visik. Visik, you are pretty decent, and I gave you some gems too. Yeah, a lot of undead. Tibera Dingeri is also moving in there. Okay, then they're moving. No, I don't know where they're moving. Ashar is moving south to uh, do some searching. Okay. I mean, it's looking pretty good, right? I think this is what I want to do. So we're going to get an attack in Numekra. Keep an eye on that, but I think that's about it, right? You press F1 to see what we're doing. Glistening Dew Forest, Windsong Forest, and Bakar. And Umrul and Godwood. We have not searched those. That's up here. The two of them are up here. Godwoods and Umrul. We'll do that later, but in the south we have not Visik, but we're moving uh, who was it here? Ashara down to go down south here and then head on over to Lomark. Well, you can go down to Windsong Forest, can't you? We'll see about that, yeah. And then we can check out these three locations. This is very close to Runia, which is probably level well, I don't know what it is. I was going to say level 3, but I don't think so. Level 3 throne is up here. Grain Coast, I'm sure of it. We're not going to mess around with that, though. Not yet. Okay, report from Miskaya. That's uh, one of the cities on the west. Suddenly, a small number of flame bolts appeared out of nowhere and struck the army located here. 60 units were hit, and these 7 units were killed. Okay, somebody's messing around here. Oceania. So now somebody who has fire. Hmm. Salu has cast Awaken Vineman. So we got that. Barakibic has reanimation. That's home in Satis. One cripple unit died, and another cripple unit, and then a battle in Vongar. In Vongar. That is not us attacking. That would be Oceania. They did attack us there. That's here. Okay, they have units. <clears throat> These units are. Hmm, yeah, they are decent, right? 25 hit points, not very much protection, defense, decent amount of damage, size 3. So, hmm, what do we have? No, we have units. I don't think he can manage this. Two sacred crocodiles. We're protecting our units in the back. I want to double check that. What do we have? Sort by owner here, and let's go down to our units. Actually, sort by, yeah, no, sort by type. We have a commander, a hero duel, and another commander. That's the province defense, I think, right? Lizard Lord. Okay, so we don't have any... Oh, Marshmaster, he's here. A boob of the Marshmaster, so he's going to be... Yeah, no, I don't see him. There he is right there. So he's defended here by these three units. Okay, that's what I gave to him. Okay, that's fine. Let's see what happens. Oh, before we do that, let's go in and turn on our squares. Okay. So our undead are moving forward, and they are all different. We are firing back here. Yeah, that's the province defense. He's coming in from that flank. That's actually pretty good, because we have our elite warriors, and they can do a lot of damage. Has a few units down here. Are they fast? Combat speed 13. They're pretty fast. 12. What do we have here? Two crocodiles. Probably okay. Probably still okay. Wait. Oh, we need a cobalt. There's the cobalt. We'll see how that does. We missed. Hmm. 
There. Okay, we're attacking them now. We're taking them out left and right there. Okay. Crocodiles are gonna catch most of them. And our guard's gonna catch the rest, I think. There. Is he gonna get by? Yeah, he got by with three. That's it. Gotta be a little bit careful. We wanna have five commanders so they can block. Because they move around randomly there, don't they? Oh no, they... Okay, they they left. Okay, good. So, Abubu, did you do any damage? Let's see. What do you get? Cobalt. Nope, nothing, nothing. Oh, there we go. Cobalt. Ten points of damage. An elite warrior. Oh, that's our own unit. Great. Uh, hit the satyr. Two points of damage. Okay. Yeah, that's the problem, right? You hit your own units. Okay, they fled. They fled. Yep, we can go in and skip that. That was good. Uh, let's go look at the stats on that. What did they come in with? These, I mean, they're not as good as I was thinking they were. Lost 28, the other ones fled. We lost a few elite warriors, quite a few, seven. Long deads, expendable. More long deads, and that's it. Didn't kill anybody with the Marshmaster. Did he end up using up his uh, gems? I don't think he did. Then we have a battle in the Mecra. I want to see that. It looked like there shouldn't be too many enemies there. That's us. Oh, it's a big, hmm, big group of our units there. Nothing on the flank. Okay, he has a few. I think these are probably mainly province defense. Ah, what do you have in the back here? A Nin. Level 1 Water Mage. Probably nothing too worrisome. Tainted Present. The Traitor Prince. Meteor Trident. Lots of damage. Enhanced Leadership Values. Okay, 100. Yeah. Doesn't do too much for him there. And I think that's it. How good are these? That's a commander, but these other Enkidus. Nothing special, but a lot of hit points and decent amount of damage. And we have quite a few of our elite warriors. They have speed 10. What do we have for our pretender? 10 as well. I need to check and see what our bless is about again. We got the bless. Let's look at them here. He is now only sacred, not blessed. Didn't we get a bless? Fanaticism. Okay, more morale. That's what we got. There's our pretender coming in. Divine blessing. Okay, let's look here then. So we're blessed now. What do we get? Uh, morale 1, precision 3, strength 3, recuperation. That means you can get rid of all these diseases, afflictions, right? Strength 2, more damage. Yeah. His units are hanging back here a little bit, but okay. And we should be fine. This is our domain. Oh, is it our domain? I don't think it was, was it? Morale 30. Hostile domain. Minus 1. Yep, it is. Okay. But it's still 30. He's not going to leave, I don't think. Um, yeah, doing good damage. 75 hit points, though. See there? That's a huge negative penalty in a different domain. We should put a temple here. In the mecha. I think I want to do that right away. I mean, 75 is going to be fine for this battle, for hit points. I don't think there's any problem. But... In the future, we don't want that. non Legal cast Word of Thorns. Okay, did non Legal? did we get... No, he's a priest. He doesn't have anything. Uh, no real gems. No, that's right. What are we doing back here? Leaving? No, just defending. What are these here? Need to add guards. Probably pretty good, right? 22, 19 protection. Yes, very good slave but we can surround them with our units and that's gonna be you know a problem for them right ah you're staying here who are you now oh no well 14 you're gonna leave the adapt oh level two air mage level three asteroid if i could have taken him out and he also has lightweight scale oh it'd be nice to take that but he's gonna leave now is he no he is out of fatigue 149. He can't move. 144. We're going to catch him. We are going to catch him. That's the problem, not having any uh, commander or guards there. Yes, we took him out. That means we should get that. Well, I don't think you always get the magic items. We might be lost, I think, on the battlefield occasionally, but um, I think hopefully we'll get it. Okay, that was a Nemecria. It's a pretty good round, I think, here. What do we lose here? 
eight elite warriors, nothing really. They lost that adept of the Silver Order. That's the guy. And then everybody else as well. That's actually quite a few of these units they had. They lost a traitor prince too. The Nin survived. Okay, she was water mage, I think, right? Mm, that's it. Did we pick anything up? Yeah. There it is. The lightweight scale mail. Um, Shala. Shala picked that up. Unexpected event in Sodorth. An enhanced enchanted wellspring has been found. Miracles have been performed with its healing powers. And this has been attributed to your merciful presence. That's in Sodorth. Magic site found. Wellspring. Afflictions, I guess it removes, maybe? Unexpected event in Junkkeep. Many commoners are volunteering to serve in the militia. Defense plus 15. In Junkkeep and Sodorth. I want to look at that right away. Junkkeep is here. Defense 21. Oh, that's a very good effect. Although we don't maybe need it here. That's that. And what was Sodorth again? Here. Enchanted Field. 50 supply points. Is that the one we got? No, Wellspring. Here it is. Heals units 3. Anyone in this province has a chance of getting a permanent affliction removed each month. Which is excellent if you didn't have my special sacred effect, right? My bless there. That would be a very good thing to have, because that's always the problem. Losing the units. Now, I realize I did not move these cavemen across to the Civic Highlands. Okay, they're going to be there. It's still winter. It's early winter now, so nobody can get through. We can't get through here either. Ocals is... Well, we are safe from Ocals is what it amounts to. Numecra is now where they could come... Uh, they could attack Numecra, but that's pretty good. What are we making now? I mean, I like how things panned out this one. This turn, six water gems now instead of just five. 64. Okay, Godwoods. He did not attack, but now he has 40. We have 208. Why 208? Well, because we're already producing, you know, on repeat so many units. I don't think we need to do that. What did we say? Anything else? No. We. Oh, yeah, in Numecria, we have. Who took that? Uh, one of. Oh, Shala here took it. The light. Uh, weight scale mail protection 11 encumbrance 1 yeah I mean it's good 11 so she has protection 12 we can give it to Nun Lugal what does he have 11 doesn't do anything right oh uh, wait that's natural protection? Yeah, natural. Heroic 6. Oh, they would help. It would help, I think, if we gave him that. Let's try that. So, protection 11 right now. Shala, if you give up that and give to Nan Lugal, what do we get to Nan Lugal? Let's see if I'm right about that. Yeah, 18. Definitely worth it. Our profit. Let's make sure he gets more protection. That was a good find. Now, we have these four. Now, we have these. Oh, we have a bow here. Hmm, how many hero dolls have a bow? One, two, three, four, five. And then we have Enino has a bow too. We should actually send one more in. We're preaching. I keep him here because I want to preach more. Do we have anybody else? Any hero duel free? I don't think we do. No, I don't think we do. Otherwise, I want to send him in here and help out, right? We don't own Numecria. There's two... Uh, of these Dominion enemy Dominion flags there, which is not good. We want to do something about that. I want to build a temple. Let's build a temple here. A fortification. The reason it would be good to have a fortification is because unlike an Umbral, you can get no, you can get out from an Umbral here. But it's a good spot, right? What do we have? Mm, one Earth Gem. One Astral Pearl. One Nature Gem. 50 supply points as well. One singing stream, that's yeah, that's it's a very good spot to have your have a temple and have a fortification. Now defense zero. First of all, let's bump that up. What do we get here? Regular units. I like heavy infantry. They last, you know, for a while on the field. So if we go up to I think I need to go up to we need 10 at least, but probably 20. If I go to 20, we get 19. 
I feel 20 is usually a pretty good number there. You get enough to make a difference. They can make it, you know, engage the enemy and make some damage. It's not, you know, you need to have enough units to make a difference surrounding the enemy. He's going to build up more units in Ocals, I think. And then try to attack. He cannot come from here. Oh, wait a minute. Godwoods is actually quite exposed. There's one Earth Gem. One Crystal Flame. What are we making? Fire Gems too? Okay. So they can very well attack here, but I'm kind of leaving that open. Other than they can get to an Umbral as well. For Numecria, it's only O Calls. It's actually only O Calls, but they can definitely come from there too. Do we want to bump up defense? I think maybe it's better to bump up Numecria. This is a much better province, right? But this is the gateway. We are recruiting more, though. We're recruiting more units here. Okay, let's portion these out to Edin Osog. There. Uh, and we'll attack closest enemy. Yeah, okay, that's fine. One morale there. Keep on getting more. Getting more units in the front line, I think it's more important. Maybe getting them over here. We do have, I mean, they don't have any, hardly any units. There are eight units. They're not going to attack here. And it's going to be, it's, it's winter anyway, but they're not going to attack right away. What do we have, Miskaya, then? We're recruiting more units. I don't think I can afford to do that. If I get that down, because I want to make sure. I leave one, because it's probably partially recruited, right? Um, what do we have here? We have a lot of units now. There. Yeah, I mean, they can definitely defend here. And he's training monsters. Yep. Sacred Serpents. It's a pretty good one. Good army here, I feel. 50 units, he can have 80. We can get a few more. Then we're going to have to move somebody out. What happened here, then? Cold Bolt. Yeah, a lot of damage. But we killed one of our own units, didn't we? Um, okay, that looks pretty good. We are preaching. I think I'm going to stay, lay, stay with them here. Where they are. They're pretty good. Although, do we need... Yeah, we do need both of them, I think. What do we have? 10 in Provost Defense. Yeah. Jinport. 20 in... Yeah, that looks like a good number, right? And we are preaching... Ah! Geshi Tinana here. I want to get you over to Numecria. Because then we can hand over that extra bow that Ininu has. Ininu. Ininu. Yeah, that'd be fine. That'd be good. Now, do we stay here? Kiksano. Wait a minute. You're hiding. Yes, we should use you, shouldn't we? We should have used you before. So, what if we send him into Godwoods? If they attack, we can then try to take out one of their commanders. I think maybe that's a good idea. So sneak in there. And now we have another... Well, we have a uh, scout here. So we know more about what they have. 40 enemy units. They have a lot of defense here. That makes sense, right? This is their home province, Urk. 40 units. They might very well attack here now. But what do we do? Do we stay in... Uh, Numecria would go for Ocals. 30 enemy units plus province defense. We would take out a temple. They can only get here from Godwoods. So why would we stay? No, we're going to move. I think we're going to move here. No point taking Kixana because he has to get there before our units get there in order to assassinate somebody. But if we attack there... Yeah, Nanlugal has that lightweight armor now. So let's take that temple. See if we can eliminate that. Reducing their spread of their religion, and maybe we can get Numecria under our control, Dominion-wise. Oh yeah, that's right, we do have a pretty good army here. Yeah, we have to move there, because we're going to take this army. We'll take... Do we take everything here? Against Nugal, what do you have? Well, the only place we can go from here is either back to Stalagmia, Sordors, Yinport, or into Numecria. We cannot go to... And Umbral is only accessible from Godwoods right now, so we need to reinforce here. I think going all out for Numecria is a good idea. They can't do anything now. And we have an armor coming in here. Okay, yeah, we'll take 
We'll move in with everybody here. Two more here. Oh, there's another two more of these uh, hero duels. Okay, that's fine. It can, you know, that bow is not going to be a problem. I'll pick him up. We'll move him down here. There. I think that will do it. So, you are defending here. Yeah, we should defend here. We should keep defending, recruiting units. So, we'll backfilling now in Amecria, taking Oak Halls, hopefully. And then if they attack Godwoods, we'll attack there before anything happens. If they go down to NM World, we should be fine. We're getting more units there. But what can we do? I was going to get a temple here, weren't I? Yes, I could leave one of them here. Can I leave one? I can leave them. And even with that bow. So if we build a temple. Oh, I need 400. Okay, in that case, we have to go down. Um, anyone will want units there. What about down in Royal Forest? No, that's a temple. That's not a fortification. And I want to get units here. We could reduce... We could reduce our units here. Yeah, let's do it. Let's get to 400. There. And then we'll take... One of you, Shala. It's going to be a temple here. Yeah, it's going to be good to get this under our control more. Yeah, definitely. Let's do that. Stalagmia, I didn't pick up these units, but you know what? That's actually fine. You have a bow, Ishikalu. You're not using that bow, are you? They're undisciplined, but you know what? Uh, we're going to put them in the front row anyway. Speed 14, that's fast. If they have speed 14... We could go something like that. Just token force defending. And then on the flank, skirmish, they're just going to do what they want. Yeah, I think we'll do that. Now, you have a bow. Moving you north would be interesting. They're going to... They could come down later. Should we go back to Karnak since we're recruiting units here? And we don't have anybody. Issue Kala would be a good one to move down to Karnak and take command. Well, wait a minute. Visik, where are you going? Nowhere. You're not going anywhere. Tiberiad Ingeri. What did I give you, uh, by the way? I only gave you a black steel full plate. Did I really build that? Did I find it? Defense minus three, encumbrance four, protection 24. So that's, that's pretty decent. Yeah. But we have a lot of units here. Do we take them down to Karnak? So in a few months, it's going to be... I mean, it's early winter now. It's going to be... It's going to be a while before they are ready. Or do we go to Stalagmia? Because they have to lay siege, right? So Stalagmia is more... Yeah. If we go there instead. Keep on recruiting. They stay home in the garrison. Just keep on recruiting them. Get that army on the Visic to kind of be flexible and stay here. Here we don't need as many units. But do we need money? I don't know if I do. Ninma's moving down south. And Ashara is checking this out. We have one extra commander here. Let's go in there. We took this one. Provost Disa, defense 6 here. You're defending. I mean, I don't know why... I don't know. 22 units is not enough to attack anywhere. Umidor, I'm would we worried about it? That's too many units to take that one. It would be good to get it, because I think this is marked as a large location. So we have a high population there. But if we go up with you here, what do we have? Six in defense? Yeah, mm, it's not much, is it? It's not much. Where am I recruiting? No commander. What about here? No commander. I mean, ideally, we want to get more of these so we can cast more spells in battle, Marshmaster. As we get more research done, although we're doing conjuration and construction, which is like the two one, we don't really need to get much for using combat. So maybe it's fine. Yeah, maybe that's fine. As far as researching now, we're not getting anybody else to research. We only have three left. White Spring Grove. I, I kind of like to keep this one going with units, but can't do everything. It's maybe Sword of Earth. We don't need as many recruited. If I don't... What if we get rid of these? 
What if we do that? What do we get? 196. What can we recruit here? Not a Marshmaster, right? 235. We can get him Poisoner. I know that. And they do have a little bit of research, right? 90 gold. And they will cost us what? It's under morale. No. Um, 72 gold per year. Mm, per year. Not that much. We'll take one more, I think. And then we can go... Then we can get done faster here. I want to get construction. I want to get more items. Because I feel I have pretty good units. It's so big generals. You know, be able to deck them out would be good. Okay, I think that's what I want to do. Here. Moving in here. And... Um, we're taking on Ocals. Pushing up units there. I don't... I don't know. Oceana seems to be attacking every turn now, though. They do attack every turn. But I don't think they can take Vongar. Miskaya they can't get to. Jinport they can definitely get to. But we have units there. Yeah. Wait, you're defending? Uh, final rest. We don't need that there. We can do a Preach here instead, can't we? Level 1. So, we can get to level 2. I think that's what I want to do, right? We're not getting any new items. So I'm slowly accumulating enough Water Gems here to be able to get that Sea King's Court. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. So we're moving in a Scout here, or an Assassin. Kick Sanu and see if we can assassinate somebody if they take it. And then O calls for an attack, and then we'll build up forces in Numecria. I'd say we do that. Let's go ahead and, and check that out. Research and Conjuration completed. Great. <clears throat> That's level 6. Seek King's Court, right? Awaken Vineman. Reanimation. Reanimation. One unit died. Battling Godwoods. They did attack us. They're going to take it. But let's see what they have. Okay, quite a few. Quite a few, but now they have one of these... Hmm. Okay, and one of the, these here as well. Okay, so we can try to assassinate. And there's another one here, a red one. The Gala. Okay, we can probably assassinate somebody. They have a lot of different commanders. A lot of mages here. Wolves there. We're not going to make it. <laughs> We're not going to make it. Let's see what they do. Quick and self blessing. Okay, they're going to do blessing, I guess. So what did they get for blessing? I'm sure you are blessable yourself. What do you get? They are blessed. Morale 1, fire resistance 1. It's not going to help. Awe. Okay, awe is going to help. But not a whole lot. There are the wolves coming in. Oh, they're going to take out the province defense there. Yeah. Maybe we'll kill a wolf or two. It's possible. They're not very strong. No. I'd be surprised if we took out a wolf. Yeah, well, maybe one. Yeah, I think we took out one. That's in Godwoods. Oh, we took out seven. Ooh, I missed that totally, but that's fine. Okay, so a handful of iron warriors, that's what they got there. Protection is decent. Good amount of hit points. Good damage. But compared to the elite warriors, yeah, I think we can we can take that back. And then in Ocals, we attacked as well. Let's see what they have here. It didn't look like they would have that much. That's us. And we have our Pretender. We should win. No, they're not going to make it. And then we're going to raise... Uh, we're going to take out that Temple. That's what we're going to do. We're getting Fanaticism. Morale goes up. This is not our province. 86 here. Dominion penalty minus 100. It's bad. Now remember, our Pretender here is extra good in Spring. So with spring times, we can probably take on more enemies. Yeah, they're going to lose this one. Yep, that's good. We took them out. There's no way they can make it here. Yeah, they're they're done for. They're fleeing. Okay. What did we get then in O-Calls? We killed... Or two of our elite warriors died. And they all died. Yep. Didn't get many kills here, did we? No. Well, that's fine. Enemy temple was found and was swiftly raised. Excellent. I like that. 
unexpected event in Lomark, a magic item has been found and transported to Arcane Laboratory. Soul contract gained. Um, miscellaneous, under the command 10, no forger bonus. Hmm. One devil. Item is cursed. If you give it to somebody, they cannot remove it. Tainted. There we got horror marked. Which I can't remember that what that is, but level three, this is expensive. But you get a devil. Hmm. <clears throat> So what happens here? The blood mage sacrifices nearly five score slaves. Yeah, get the attention of infernal powers. Whoever signs the contract promises his soul to be collected at the time of his death to the infernal lord. In exchange for this fair and valuable consideration, hmm, the signatory will, for as long as he lives, receive one bound devil each month. We should give it to somebody right away. We can give it to for as long as he lives. So you got to think about that. How long are they going to be? Well, we can give it to somebody else, I guess. But we can give it to the hero duel. Or maybe just, you know... Somebody we're going to have in an army anyway. I do want to give it to somebody. Well, I can think about that next turn, I think. Wait a minute, what do we have down here? Ig... Yet the ancient kraken. Hmm. They can't go ashore, can they? Surely they can't. Did we get um, defense everywhere? We did not. Oh, calls Namekra. Yeah. Okay. Namekra and Ocos. We haven't actually put anything in Namekra. We got to do that right away. Um. Well. I, mm. Well. Okay. We decide on that later. I put six for now, but yeah. And then they took Godwoods here. But we can take that back, and now we have Kixano. I'm going to tell them, assassinate enemy commander, and see what we can do. They can come now for enemy world, if we're not careful, but I think we're going to take our army under, is it, uh, yeah, Lulav Zagesi and those guys, Nisha Barguna. They can move north and take that. I think we're going to find now that uh, they're losing quite a bit in influence, in dominion here. They have three temples left. I wonder what happened to Jotunheim. Asphodel is here, coming in as well. Oh, wait, Bill Fields. Yeah, I mean, if they attack here, we don't have hardly anything to defend with, but we've got to make sure I have an army. Ninlis can take a few. Ninma defending there. Maybe moving up. Up, actually. This is a good central location, I think. Vilia, we have 14 defense? Hmm. That's an odd number. Karnag, nothing there because they can't get across yet. And Visik is here now, in Stalagmia. So we can defend there pretty well. What if we... Yeah, hmm. I'm recruiting... Not recruiting anything. Okay. Probably want to recruit these now, right? Cold resistant is very good against Jotunheim, right? Protection is low, defense is low, but they get 23 hit points and do a lot of damage. So that would be something to get. 684 now. Oh, calls? What do we get? Oh, uh, there's nothing there. Oh, calls. Yeah, nothing at all. We don't know what's there. Numecria, do we see what? No, there's... we haven't searched, so we don't know what's there. Okay. Well, I will, um... Ah, uh, look. Riley is here, so they're gonna be... Yeah, they're in the uh, Oceania units, and, and uh, Riley's gonna come... Yeah, they're gonna be fighting it out there. Anyway, I'll come back next time. We'll continue then, I guess.